Lindsay Renee Lagesty is gone. What's up, Crush Crew? Lindsay Renee from Dixie Crush. Here. But her voice will never be forgotten. The 25 year old was the lead female singer of the country music cover band Dixie Crush. Lindsay's mom, Linda, tells me her daughter sang her heart out every time she got on the stage. She said that music is, is your soul and it's your heart and it's your life. The South Suburban Chicago girl with a beautiful voice and brilliant mind was struck and killed while walking to a Valentine's Day performance. Her family waiting for her to show up. About 20 after when I saw an ambulance pass, I started getting nervous and that's when he said, I got a text from her at 5 after 7 that she was looking for a place to park. Chicago police say an elderly driver struck her while she was grabbing her microphone out of the back seat of her car. Lindsay later died at the hospital. This happened when she's supposed to be settling down and, and having starting to live her life. Lindsay accomplished more than most people do in a lifetime. She had her doctorate in pharmacy, connecting not just with those in her audience, but her patients too. I care about everybody, no matter who they were. People that came to the show, customers that came up to the window, and everybody knew how much she really cared. Lindsay's family has the pictures and the memories. And I'm excited to be back to do a video for you guys. And will always have the sound of her voice. And Lindsay was laid to rest earlier today, but her family telling me tonight they'll continue to keep her memory alive, doing everything they can to uh, try and make sure that her legacy lives on. Okay, such a sad so story. Yeah, very sad. Sad. She accomplished so much, though. I mean, to be a pharmacist already at 25 and be a lead singer. So She would have been great. Thank you so Thank much. You.